Boeing has unveiled an electric vertical takeoff and landing air cargo drone. The prototype is designed to transport a payload up to 500 pounds. Just think, a drone transporting heavy cargo. Would it look like this? This? Or more like this? The prototype can fly as long as 15 minutes, carrying up to 150 pounds. It's 15 feet long, 18 feet wide, 4 feet tall, and almost 750 pounds. The design is meant to carry a payload up to 500 pounds, meaning it could scale up to be even larger. Engineers launched successful test flights inside Boeing's Collaborative Autonomous Systems Laboratory in St. Charles, Missouri. One of the most amazing things about this project is that we were able to build this air vehicle from concept to first flight in three months. That is unprecedented in this environment and in this market. Boeing Horizon X, with its partners in Boeing Research and Technology, led the development of the Cargo Air Vehicle, or CAV. Rather than semis carrying large cargo alongside us, imagine one of these carrying cargo above us. I can see it happening in the urban-based environments. Boeing predicts it will travel distances up to 20 miles and fly between 60 and 70 miles per hour, as high as a few hundred feet, which is good for what they call short hop deliveries. We saw this emerging market of cargo-based drones. Now, we've heard about it from Amazon and the small package deliveries, but what we saw was a market segment that was much larger than that. What we see emerging is a need for a more efficient way of moving product from point A to point B. It includes ourselves. We have many plants that are spaced enough that it would be beneficial even for us to have an ability to move parts from one part of the plant to the other. The electric vertical takeoff and landing CAV is powered by an electric propulsion system. It is operated using eight rotors. Each of those rotors are six foot in diameter and produce the horsepower that is needed to lift the vehicle and its payload. As the propulsion IPT lead, I am responsible for the propellers, the motors, the motor controllers, the power distribution system, and the integration of all those components. So we leverage technologies that you see in today's typical quadcopters. We've got a set of clockwise and counterclockwise rotating propellers. However, we have put them in a coaxial configuration to give us additional payload capacity and additional stability to the platform to make it safer for operations. Boeing is also engaged in the development of energy storage to advance the drone's performance. When you talk about an all-electric based vehicle, energy storage is important. That gives you duration, allows you to, to command the distances you can go, um, would also have impacts on speed. So we have research and development areas that are researching how to address that energy storage piece. We used what we had today in order to create the prototype, and then we have an ability to advance that and modify it as we move forward. The next step is testing the cargo air vehicle off-site and outdoors. We have the opportunity to not be tethered, not be held to a building, and see what it can do when it is out in the open. First is, yeah, can we do it? Can we create this product and demonstrate its capability? But the other thing it allows us to do is to really experiment and really understand how does it do that integration? How do we work with our partners in the FAA and other municipalities to understand how will these things emerge and as they emerge, how will they really integrate into the airspace and do it safely such that people have faith and then working on also the policy and regulation that needs to come along with these as they proliferate. For innovators at Boeing, turning an idea into reality is like a dream come true. Seeing Boeing reach out into a new market, leveraging all of our experience, all of our skills in multiple areas and pull them together into something that we've never done before, that's really exciting. And, and it's, you know, anytime you get to see an air vehicle fly, that's what we live for. As an aerospace engineer, that's what I want to see, that's what I want to be a part of, and that's what we were able to do with the cargo air vehicle. 
for Innovations. I'm Kathleen Berger.